So what exactly is a potentiometer? A potentiometer, or POT for short, is a three-terminal variable resistor. It lets you adjust a resistance manually by rotating a knob or a sliding lever. Inside, there is a resistive track with a contact point called the wiper that moves to vary the resistance between the terminals. It's super common in electronics, especially when you want to control things like volume, brightness, or even position. Let's take a closer look at how it's built. A typical potentiometer has three terminals. Terminal A, one end of the resistive element. Terminal B, the other end. And the terminal C, the wiper, which slides along the resistive path. When you turn the knob, you are physically moving the wiper, changing how much resistance lies between the terminals. This movement affects the electrical output. Now, how does a potentiometer actually works? It based on the voltage divider principle. When you apply a voltage across the two fixed terminals A and B, the wiper in between gives you a variable output voltage. The formula is as following. As the wiper moves, it changes the values of the R1 and R2. So the voltage at the wiper also changes. This simple principle makes the potentiometer super useful in the analog circuits. There are few different types of potentiometer depending on how you adjust them. The first we have a rotary potentiometer that's a classic knob you turn. Next is the linear potentiometer which you slide up and down often using the audio mixing consoles. And finally the digital potentiometer which uses the digital signals instead of manual movement. Perfect for the microcontroller based systems. So where potentiometers actually used? You have probably used one today without even knowing it. They are everywhere in audio equipment for the volume control, in joysticks for the position control, and in the TV remotes to adjust the brightness or sound. They are also used in the industrial machines for calibration and even in the robotics to detect the motion or the feedback. In short, if something needs the manual adjustment, there's good chance a potentiometer is involved. If you have learned something today, go ahead, like, share and subscribe and drop a comment below.